hello beautiful people welcome back again to my youtube channel how are you guys doing nollywood actor zubi michael took to his instagram handle to blast the yoruba organizers by calling them ndiala ndiala this came as a result of the african magic viewers choice award so he took to his instagram handle to express his feeling before we dive into this gist, if this is your first time of being to my channel, you are highly welcome. My name is Jennifer. Please do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Be part of this family by subscribing and when you subscribe, click the notification bell beside it. That will enable you to get all my notifications whenever I put out a new video. And to you, my amazing returning subscribers, God bless you guys for always coming back to show me love. I really appreciate it. So I'm going to share the, the post with you guys so that we all can read it together. Some things are unchangeable. Example, can you change your biological father? That award was a joke and highly political. Ndiala, Ndiala, we know we are great without the fake awards. Do you know the meaning of viewer's choice? I'm sure most of the organizers are Yoruba. They did not even recognize the pillars of Nollywood. The original owner of Living in Bondage was not mentioned. But New Living in Bondage got eight award. Our dead, our dead heroes like Sam Loco and others were not mentioned. Awards without people that made Mama G, Aki and Popo, Pet, Edochi, Anayoko, Anayo. So this is what he posted on his IG. Do you support him by calling Yoruba organizers Ndiala Ndiala as in mad people? Do you support him? Do you think he did the right thing? If you do, let me know your reason in the comment section. So in response to that, one of his colleagues by name Angelo Kore replied Zubi Michael for saying it is Yoruba award. And here is what she said. You should be happy for those that won and also work harder to recognize light up your own world don't stay in the dark and complain stop blaming people for not making you become better version of yourself aren't easy to get there bro keep working till you get there one day go pay be happy for people definitely yours will come if envy isn't dictated she wrote so guys what do you have to say about this whole thing Angela coming out to say Zubi Michael should, um, you know, focus on making it so that he will be recognized. And Zubi Michael calling Yoruba organizer's name. What do you have to say about this whole thing? Do you think that Zubi Michael is just being jealous for nothing? Let me know what you think about this in the comment section. Moving on. Remember the video I shared with you guys about a man who was preaching in public and they called him a madman because of the way he was looking? To me, I don't believe that this man is a madman. I believe that he's a man that God sent to pass a message across to his people. But people see him because of the way he looks and they think he's a madman. Like, I don't really believe that, okay? But if you have not seen that video on how he was really preaching, you need to watch that video, okay? So that you understand the reason why I say to me, he doesn't look like a madman to me. Forget about his look and all that, okay? Just focus on the message that he was passing across. So I will leave the link of that video in the description box. Feel free to check it out before you watch this one, okay? So there's this new update about him, how he was being transformed and all of that, all thanks to Kokuna Foundation. Is it Kokuna Foundation? I don't know if I'm pronouncing it right. I'm going to write the the name on the screen for you guys, okay? So make sure you stay tuned. <laughs> How are you doing? Not a cute guy. Is that yeah. you looking more handsome now? How are you doing, sir? This is this is the man mm -hmm. that called on us to say we must come to worry. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah? And um, we were worried on his request because he was interested in seeing that we get there and we have a discussion with you and we are happy. Everything. I hope you are settling down anyway. Are you fine? I can't say I'm fine, but I'm not. Why? It's not why? Why? What's wrong? Why? 
what happened? That's because I've not been in one place, just sitting down in one place. You've never been in one place, so you like to go in up and down? I just, I like getting through in that interesting place. Yeah. So mm -hmm. what, okay, what do you want? What do you think we can give for you? What do you want? What do you really want? Address the You're issue. looking so calm, you understand? So, this is not what I was expecting, but I'm so happy to see you like this. And I believe that, like that said, like the psychologist will talk to you, they will know what. But going back to your family, that one is 100% certain. You understand your point. But still, we need to support you that, okay, use this for your trade, what kind of trade. You understand? Your family, you are going to be them. Like I said, you are there for a short period of time. I hope you understand. Um, so, what I expect you to say to this young man is to say, thank you very much. That's what I expect you to say. Because, first and foremost, he has used us to get in contact with you and is working on how to really solve and make sure you have something that you will be doing. When you get back home, if it is aluminium you want to be doing, aluminium frame. You can, what I'm you, sure you, you can you, have your own shop. You can have your own shop. So these are the things yeah. we will help you to put in yeah. place. That's what they are saying. That's what he's trying to say. So what I expect you to say to him. In the name of God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Thank you so much. In the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Father, I thank you, Lord, thank for you. Woken us, taking us to bed and putting us up this morning. We thank you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, Lord, the over King of glory, your word say, We are one or two are gathered here. You, here you are in their midst. Yes, yes. Father, may your name be praised in the name of Jesus. Amen. Father, Lord, I soak all of us here with the blood of, blood Jesus. of Jesus. Father, I thank you for this uh, master that you sent. It might be your will that the master is here, but I don't really know because I can't see anything, Lord. Father, I thank you. Thank you for the cooperation entirely. I thank, I, I thank you, Lord. Give you all the praise, all the honor, the adoration. Thank you, Jesus. In Jesus' name, I have prayed. Amen. 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 Thank you, Lord. So, guys, what do you have to say about this amazing transformation? Do you believe that this was the man that was preaching in the public? Look at the way he has been transformed. Like, he's really looking good now. So many people we are saying that it's wrong for them to cut his hair and all of that. What do you have to say about this? And I especially want to use this medium to thank the Coconut Foundation. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it correctly, but I'm sorry about that. So moving on guys, Nollywood actress by name Sharon, she have a message to pass across to the whole men out there. So please stay tuned, I'm going to play this video clip for you guys. And for those who don't understand Ibu, stay tuned, I'm going to explain in details for you guys what she said, okay? I'm going to something real quick. Oh, bro, I can just wear koi bonsu in my language, man. Guys, you guys always complain. When you call a girl too much, she doesn't pick your call, she doesn't reply to your text message. Unana complained. Babe, I've been calling you. Didn't you see my message? My miss, no, I got a miss call. I got a message. Man, who need you? What that? I got the video. Love is sweeter. When money enter, love is sweeter. Get that. Una what I when you need them call, I bore your call. Or my ring guy ring guy bone. It is send your test. This is where are you I see I love you. When I am meant to miss you. I am meant you look hot. I am meant to guy do the right thing. <laughs> This lady is crazy. Sharon, eh, you know where. So, guys, for those who don't understand it, but what she's basically saying is those who, who, as in men who are not rich, but you keep saying, oh, I love you, I love you, that they are not going to eat love. If you don't have money, then forget about love. Once the money is there, then they are ready to love you because money rules the world. I'm not the one that said it. That's what she said, okay? So if you ask me to me, I don't think she meant what she said. She just wants to use it in order to trend. That's it. So guys, that will be the end of this video today. If you love the if you love this video, look what my tab is. <laughs> don't mind me guys i'm just joking so that will be the end of this video today if you like it please do not forget to give it a thumbs up okay 
and also share my videos with your friends and your family facebook group whatsapp group anywhere shareable sharing is allowed in this channel for those who have been sharing my videos i say may god continue to bless you for those who are supporting me in one way or the other may god bless you too so if you're new to my channel please my darling do not forget to subscribe and click the notification bell that bell will notify you whenever i put out a new video okay with that being said, thank you guys so, so much for watching. I really appreciate. I will see you guys in my next video. Remember to stay blessed and I love you all. Bye for now.